you want to know the difference between a talented performer and a working performer, well, <laughs> it's the business of the show that hangs most people up. Real talk, I need to know that you'll be where you're supposed to be, when you're supposed to be there, hit your marks, and then deliver the goods. Know your craft. An understanding of what the work day is like on set. Oh man, you have no idea. This is gonna, this stuff is gonna blow their minds. Yeah. yeah these people in LA, New York, whatever, know your craft. This is looking really good. You're off the mark just slightly. There you go. They may not be brilliant actors, but they know the craft. Never shooting across your face. You can't be moving your head like this. That looks good, guys. They know how to hit marks. They know how to come in and do a slate and audition. They know how to give a performance that looks semi-real. The thing we're going to have to be careful of, and what I'm seeing what's going on here, is that you know, they may be hitting all the marks, right, but losing all those human qualities and talking like a real person. All of a sudden, the characters are becoming very stale kind of thing. That's the one thing people have control over is their training. They don't have control if they walk in the door at the right time. They don't have control if someone's going to pick them or not pick them. The only thing they have control over is their talent and the training of their craft. So start with that. If you can do that, you can write your own ticket in this town.